along unless a girlfriend comes with us. So I figure you come along and go out with a girlfriend. I couldn't wait to get away. Wake Joe. I couldn't stand him. I thought he was really obnoxious. He kept fidgeting around. Tommy made us promise to meet them again on Friday night. We agreed. Of course, when Friday night came around, Henry stood me up. But I made Tommy take me looking for him. I remember she's screaming on the street, and I mean loud, but she looked good. I'll think about it. I'm gonna push you, Bill. I'm gonna make it up. I'm gonna push you a lot. She had these great eyes, just like Liz Taylor's. He was an exciting guy. It was really nice. Guy, Liz across the street from me that I've known all my life. If you touch her again, you're dead! Oh. There are women like my best friends who would have gotten out of there the minute their boyfriend gave them a gun to hide. But I didn't. I gotta admit the truth. It turned me on. Mazel tov! That is my dream. What's up YouTube, Stack44 coming in with another video. Women appeal to the high value male. Before I get started, I want to get a shout out to all my new subscribers, all my regular subscribers, and if you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscription button on the corner of your screen and hit that notification bell as well, and you get all my videos sent straight to your phone or your device as soon as I put one up on YouTube. But let's get right into this video. I told you guys it was going to be a part two to the video of the spoiled woman that uh, never respects a simp. And this is part two of it. A woman will always appeal to a high value male. So uh, I used the 1990 Goodfellas clip starring Ray Liotta showing the relationship he had with uh, Karen in the movie. Um, basically showing how they, you know, how they met, how they got married and then pretty much how they was in the marriage. It didn't show everything. It showed all bo most of the good times. There was some bad times in there too. If you've seen the movie, you know what I'm talking about. But at the end of the day, if you look at the clip in the beginning, when he first started going out with her, he wasn't really too, you know, fond to it. He was straight working on his purpose. You know, he was working on his purpose with his uh, business with the mafia and stuff like that. So basically high value males are more entertained about what they got to do for themselves to better themselves to work on themselves they don't really put women on the pedestal the opposite of a simp you know we talked about the simp in the last video a simp basically you know has to fulfill a void by you know giving a woman cash and prizes to get what he want out of woman a high value male works on his purpose works on himself he hits the gym. He keeps himself well groomed. He he his first his first thing of the day is not thinking about women. He's thinking about what he has to do to you know keep this money flowing, 
keep the success in his in his life. And if you notice in the movie, when he didn't show her, give her validation, as like he was putting her on a pedestal, she chased it, his validation. She chased it him. And once she once he seen the interest in her, he kind of gave her the validation back. Eventually, they meshed. That you know they had a good connection and they ended up getting married. And now the rest is history. And at the end of the day, you seen you know he he actually spoiled her because she earned the, to earn to be spoiled. You know some women feel like they feel be spoiled just because these simps out here got them you know kind of confused. But a woman has to earn her right for a man to respect her to the point that he's gonna honor and protect her. And then in the clip, it showed that a guy disrespected her that lived across the street from him, and he went over there and pistol whipped the hell out of him and gave her the gun afterwards to her to hide it. And, you know, high-value males will be, we're good providers. We take care of ourselves. We, we do what we got to do on a daily basis, and we take care of our women when they earn that respect. But we just don't come out out the blue like, oh, I'm going to do this for you and do that for you. That's a simp move, you know. A man has to understand if a woman, well, a woman's value is because when he's high value himself, he met, he looking for equal value. He wants somebody equally yoked, and you know that understands that if something bad happened when he's on his value and he goes down, that you're not just gonna run out the door. If he sees that you love him or like him for who he is, he'll rock with you, but. If he knows that you're like thirst trapping, which I call um, simp hunting, then he could feel that he could feel that energy. Real high value males feel feel energy for you know a woman being a thirst trap type chick or a chick that's you know gold digger. High value males feel that energy as well, you know. So when you're the best version of yourself, period, woman or man. You feel the thirstiness on people. So that's why I always tell you guys, plan, purpose, program. Hit the gym. Get your mind right mentally. You know, I respect, I mean, I appreciate you guys listening to me, listening to guys like GMB, Coach Warren, you know what I mean, BOA. You listen to people like that, you will get your mind right. You know, Alpha Kingdom, listen to people that's going to help you understand what going on out here in this manosphere because at the end of the day it's a delusional world and it's the real world and high value males live in the real world and they take care of their body they care take care of their finances they take care of their family life they kept up and they, they work on their spiritual all the time and they always put god first and everything else follow they don't put a pedestal on a woman a lot of these simps out here they're chasing women. You know, the biggest difference between men and women is women mature faster than us sexually because when y'all hit puberty, guys, y'all been saying no to sex every day of your life. Think about that. Most men that's have to build themselves up to get to that, to be that commodity, to be that theme that I'm saying, they get to pick and choose after a while. They didn't play the field and now they know they value. Like when they how they have self-respect for themselves. They respect, they don't sleep with anybody. They 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 have their choice of who they want to deal with, <clears throat> excuse me, and who they don't want to deal with. That's the biggest difference between a simp and a high-value male. High-value male pretty much is experience. Been there, done that. A simp is like a rookie. He never been there, never you know, did what he should have done in life because he might have been raised unbalanced. Most high-value males are raised with balance. And if they're not raised with balance, they go find a balance to help them balance themselves out to be a best version of themselves for anything that they are crossing their life. But yeah, I don't want to keep going on this video. I think you guys understand what I'm saying between the high-value male and a woman is always appeal to it because at the end of the day, it's simps out there that basically will always put a woman on the pedestal, but a woman will leave a simp to go fuck, go mess with a high value male, period, or a bad boy. It's either two things a woman wants: a man that can take control, a man that knows himself, love himself, or a man that's gonna be a little bit, you know, a little bit um, 
a daredevil outrageous bad boy but that's all i really want to say in this video guys is just you know follow up from the simp video to understand let you guys understand that it's other people out there in this world that's doing that's working on themselves and being the best version of themselves and they're out there winning winning too you know these simps out here when they run out of the money what the hell they got you know a woman gonna leave his ass when he leave you know he don't get a deal it'll be a deal or no deal so when the deal's up he's she's out so but guys remember like comment subscribe you know check me out check all my other videos out let's stack attack our lives let's stack up our lives and i'll holler at you guys on the next video peace